Good morning vlog! So today is game day, it's playoff season. I'm wearing my lucky Chiefs jersey, my Kelsey one. And I'm in the middle of making my favorite Rotel. Got the turkey cooking. I've already got the spicy Rotel in here. And then some cream cheese. It's just three simple ingredients, but it is so good. And then, I don't know, like I'm debating if I should order some pizza later or not. We'll see. But right now I'm watching the Lions Buccaneers game. And I'm the Chiefs have never lost when I wore this jersey. So hopefully it brings me good luck today. I've also, weirdly enough, never washed this jersey. Like since um, I bought it. So it's like, you know, good luck. Um, so hopefully it brings us luck today. We're looking for a Kansas City win. Welcome back to my channel. Today is Friday and tonight, tonight's my favorite night, is girls night y'all, okay? So we're going to go downtown San Diego. We'll be eating at the Lionfish and then we're going to House of Blues for this R&B night. So I need something to wear, so let's figure it out. <laughs> Okay, you guys, so I got a bunch of clothes for Vegas because in a couple of weeks we're going to Vegas for the Super Bowl and I think it's going to be like cold so I wanted like some warmer outfits. So I have all of the Shein stuff that I got but I don't know like what I want to wear. Okay, first of all, this hat is so cute. Let me show you. Okay, so I've been wanting like a Mickey pom-pom vibe type of hat. Um, I don't know, it's just super cute. A little like beanie. I didn't realize it said Brooklyn on it. Like, I don't really have any vibes. I don't have anything against Brooklyn, but I don't really have any like ties to Brooklyn, you know? So, um, I didn't know that that was a thing, but it's cute. I'm not wearing this tonight, but I just, I just wanted to show you what it was. It's cute. Okay guys, so first off, let's open our first Shein haul bag. Let's see what we got. I do not remember getting this. What is this? I don't remember ordering this. Huh. Ooh, I think this is supposed to be the black faux fur one that I got, but I mean, I guess, huh, look, y'all, this is not what I expected. I don't know. It's just like a long, furry, fuzzy coat. This was, this is what, I didn't think this was going to look like this. I mean, it's okay. I don't know, I might keep it. It's like a little, a little cozy vibe, but definitely not what I thought it was gonna be. We're off to a rocky start, y'all. Rocky. First of all, I didn't know about this, and this, I don't know, this isn't like, it's not giving what I thought it was gonna be giving. Okay, now this one I am excited about because it's a little fur coat vibe. And it's like long. This is like a vibe. Fun fact, when I was a kid, I used to have a real fur coat. Like, first of all, I'm from Missouri. So that's like before like PETA was like such a big thing. And I still have it. Um, I'm probably gonna hand it down to my knees, but this is cute. This is cute, nice and warm. I mean, Vegas, right? Like, faux fur, why not? And we're just like going out in San Diego, like if, you know, to class up a little number or something. I like it. I also like got some gloves to like, just go with the aesthetic. These are just pretty basic. They're cute. I like the little deer emblem on there. Cute. To go with my hat, it's a vibe. You guys, I've been wanting to go someplace with snow lately. 
And at the time I placed this order, it was snowing in Vegas. So I feel like it's important to say that, like for perspective. Apparently I also ordered shoes. How do I not remember what I ordered on this order? It's wild to me. The good thing is Shein has like a really easy return policy. So if I don't like anything, like I don't have to stress about like being stuck with it. Unlike Fashion Nova. Oh yeah, okay. So these are like rain snow boots that I got with like little furs on them. It's like a cute little vibe, simple. Hopefully they fit. I'm gonna try those on later. Man, I was like really on a winter vibe buy like when I made all of these purchases. Okay, and then this is like just a cute little sweatsuit. I figure I'll wear on the way to Vegas. It's just tan sweatpants. And then this is like the hoodie. Just like a simple little vibe on the cozy coat. None of these are things that I can wear to girls' night tonight. Like, none of them. But hold on, I have an idea. Dun, 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 dun. Fashion Nova. Okay, so I also have a Fashion Nova package. This one feels real heavy because I ordered like this all leather outfit. But I don't remember what else I ordered. I have a feeling we're going to find what we need in here. Okay, we're going to open up the first item. Heel yeel. So this is a nice like leather bodysuit. This might be a vibe for tonight for girls night. This seems like is not appropriate. Okay, we're gonna leave this out because like we can probably pair this with something. Y'all, I lost my mind when I was shopping on Shein. Like, what was what was I doing? Okay, next one. I was also on a leather kick this day. Like, yes. Okay, like this top, this top is everything. Like, look how freaking cute this is. I don't know what I'm gonna pair this with because I don't really have like any like brown pants, but look, I will figure it out because this is freaking sexy. Like, I will literally buy something to match this. Ooh, this I think is. The next two are like bangers, y'all. I'm so excited about this. Look, you gotta be real decisive with your Fashion Nova stuff because their return policy is not good. So these are the green leather widely good pants. These are so cute. Hold on. Like, look how cute those are. Love it. And then it has a matching top. Then this is the top that goes with it. So cute, right? Like that might be an outfit for tonight, but I kind of want to save this one for Vegas. And then this is also an option for tonight, but I have a feeling I'm going to be wearing this all the time. I saw this months ago and wanted this so bad, but they were sold out of my size. And when I was on there yesterday, they restocked and it was like so cute. So I went ahead and I ordered it. It is this denim romper. It's just so cute. Okay. I kind of want to try this on because this might be a vibe for tonight. So hold that thought. Okay, you guys, this is like so cute, but it's like a little, it's a little tight. <laughs> it's a little tight. So she might have to wait till spring. But how cute is she? Okay, like, it's a vibe. I'm obsessed with this outfit. Like, I really like it. Love it, but she's not for tonight. Like, 
she's for a later date and time so let me try on another combo okay so this one is cute I don't know if it's like for a girls night like I feel like I need something like I feel like I need more sex for girls night like something sexier for girls night okay like this is cute but it's it's not giving what I needed to okay so this could be a vibe for girls night I don't know what do you guys think it has some structure to it maybe Okay, I'm gonna put on kind of what I'm leaning towards. I don't know, this is like a vibe. Like if we accessorize this, this could be a thing. Okay, or I have this black bodysuit. It's just a plain black bodysuit. Like really simple and chill. But it, you know, shows the Chi Chi's a little bit. I don't know, like with some accessories, like with some boots. My only fear about this is like we're going to like a DJ night and I feel like if I wear this, I'm gonna get really hot, like really hot. So I don't know, like I really wanna wear this, but then I feel like I'm gonna get hot. So I don't know. I mean, it's cute and I can put it like with like some really cute like boots to like spruce it up. I just, I don't know. It does make my butt look good too though. <laughs> I don't know, maybe. Okay guys, this might be the vibe. I'm kinda loving this. I don't know, is this the outfit? Is this the vibe? Am I not skinny enough for this? Girls, this is a conversation I have with myself all the time. I don't know, I think it's cute. I just, I love the top. Like, the top is a yes for me. Obsessed. But what about the bottoms? Like, I feel like we can, like we can rock with this. We can accessorize this in. I feel like this should be our outfit for tonight. What do y'all think? Okay y'all, it's Girls Night at the Pendry. This is my outfit, it's what I went with. Reading at Lionfish tonight. It's supposed to be a favorite of Mariah Carey and LeBron James. So I'm excited to have some really good food. I'm waiting on the girls to get here and I think I'm gonna go grab a drink at the bar while I wait.
hump day. Today is Wednesday and I am prepping to go to Vegas. We are going to Vegas for Super Bowl weekend. Unfortunately, we don't have tickets to the game, but we're still gonna go and have a great time. It's also Valentine's Day weekend and I'm getting ready to wrap Arthur's present. So for Valentine's Day, I got him the blenders coach prime glasses um we went out to eat like a couple of weeks ago um for sushi and our server actually had them on and arthur was like oh those are nice like he commented on it and uh then they had this whole discussion about the blender sunglasses so i thought it'd be cute to surprise him with a little gift um and then of course i'm also gonna like treat him at least to one meal like why we're in vegas I just got my highlights redone courtesy of Ulta Beauty Salon. My girl Adriana did them and it looks fantastic. I'm kind of like on the vibe of getting slowly lighter blonde. I'm like working my way back to it. But honestly, I feel like this is a perfect shade. Like I'm probably gonna keep this. It's like a really creamy, pretty like hints of honey in there. I'll show you guys like the back. Like it just, uh, it's perfection. It's gonna grow out nicely and I'm really excited. So today I got up, I grabbed my Better Buzz coffee. Um, I actually door dashed it like while I was getting my hair done um, just because I didn't have time and I hate being late. I feel like it's so disrespectful to be late and um, not just be aware of other people's like time and money and energy. So I was actually 10 minutes early but I didn't get stopped to get my coffee so I just door dashed it in. So let's wrap this and then we're gonna go upstairs and pack oh i'm so excited i got base luggage for christmas so this is gonna be my first time using it um but basically i'm packing today because i work tomorrow and then we're gonna get up really early on friday and head out to vegas we're driving we're taking the bmw um so it's our first long distance trip in the electric car so that's gonna be kind of cool um and we've got like some really good like uh, dinner reservations and different things. Um, as you guys know, I'm a diehard Kansas City Chiefs fan, so my team is in the Super Bowl! And Arthur is a 49ers fan, so his team is also in the Super Bowl, so it's gonna be a long weekend, y'all. Very long. But we're gonna have a lot of fun, and I'm excited to take you guys along with me. This vlog is just gonna be kind of my vacation prep figure you guys can pack with me i did a little like cleanup i hate coming home to like a dirty house so we're just kind of like cleaning tidying up do what we need to do um and yeah that's that's pretty much it so let's get into it the music. morning guys so yesterday i did not pack for vegas i 
I watched TV instead. I just didn't do it. But this morning I woke up and my husband is like so excited about this 49ers game. He literally, he's such a troll, okay? Like he likes to troll me because I'm a Chiefs fan and he literally laid out all of his 49ers outfits in the kitchen for me to see first thing when I came down here this morning. So I'm gonna show you guys what he's packing for Vegas. Um, we normally don't get to see his little process. So um, I'm, I'm gonna show you. And like, tell me why, like, did you have to stage it in in the dining room? Sir, this is, this is mutual territory, okay? Like, what are we doing? So he starts out simple with his jean options. He's taking two apparently. He has the new Travis Scott dunks that he's taking. These are pretty sick. He's got all of his 49er gear. He's got his beanie. He's got his Bay Area shirt and Nike. I guess this is gonna be one fit, you guys. Like, look, I'm rubbing off on him. He's putting whole looks together. And then he has his two hat options. This is like cracking me up. He's taking his booty socks, his Movado watch. He's got the Tom Ford and the YSL with his sensitive skin soap. He's taking some dress shoes, I see. Not him with three pairs of shoes. Okay, and this is another look. <laughs> look, okay, so I would just like to say, these are new shoes. He hasn't actually wore them out yet. So as you can see, they're just sitting on the chair because they're literally brand new, they're not dirty. He laid out a napkin in the chair and then accessorized it with these shoes. And then he's got like this nice polo shirt, nice with a nice jacket. It is supposed to be like cold there. Then he has his Nike fit packed. I also like to say he picked me out an outfit. He requested that I wear this uh, Fear of God Essentials hoodie with some black leggings. And he also picked out my shoes for me. He wants me to wear my cream Adidas for the car right over there. And then I guess this is just like his chill lounge. And yet still bougie for everybody who talks about me. He's got his expensive classic neck tees. He's got his little hoodie. And I can almost guarantee you in this bag, he has his Nike Tech outfit. You guys, look at this. Boom, boom. He included an outfit for me. And boom, like, y'all, if I haven't rubbed off on him. <laughs> the great part about this is we're gonna be able to like coordinate outfits easily. So now I have to like get it together. I had to be at work at two. So I'm gonna start like laying out my looks and I have some new stuff that I haven't tried on yet. So I guess, guess I just need to like see how that goes. But it seems like he's wearing red like every single day. I hadn't really planned on doing that because it's Vegas, um, but we'll see. All right guys, so this is what I have so far. I have my Travis Kelsey jersey. How dirty it is, it's got makeup and stuff on it. Um, but I'm a little superstitious, but I'm definitely gonna bring that with me because I'm probably gonna wear this to watch the game. I'm a little undecided. I have this red leather moto outfit, which will be good for going out in the evening or dinner or something like cool. Love this fit. Um, I'm also bringing my satin pants. This is like a repeat outfit that I wore recently, but then I'm also bringing the shirt that I wore to Beyonce, like as an option to change out in case we end up like going to a club or something cool. I got new pajamas on deck. I'm taking my black leather coat. I like the Levi's one cause it's like lined and it has a hood in it just in case. I'm taking this faux fur long coat. And then this is for dinner at Beauty and Essex, like for Valentine's Day. This is going to be like really cute. And then I have this just black crew neck chief's fit. And that's what I have so far. So we're going to leave tomorrow morning on Friday. So I already have my car fit going up there. And then tomorrow night, I don't know what we're gonna get into. I know tomorrow we're gonna like go around and kind of like see the sights. I think we're gonna go down um, by Lake Las Vegas, which is where the teams are staying at and just kind of explore that area because we've never done that before. Um, we're probably gonna get some Korean barbecue tomorrow. Like tomorrow daytime is gonna be pretty chill. And since we're leaving at like literally late, 
latest we're leaving from San Diego is 8 30 and we're gonna try to leave earlier um we should be pretty set to go I'm also gonna bring my cheese blanket so I can cuddle up in the car in it <laughs> I always bring an extra blanket with me uh especially for road trips um and then saturday we are eating lunch at the caesar's buffet so that's going to be kind of like a, a more chill day walking around we don't really have plans for dinner we're just like keeping our options open so we'll see what we like get into on that and then um i'm definitely going to make sure that i bring my red lipstick it's going to be a red lip weekend like I already know like I need I need that stunna paint by Fenty um and uncensored like so my makeup's gonna coordinate look this is my favorite red lip my chief's red lip because a lot of people ask me they're like what is it it's this one it's so pretty I love it uncensored by Rihanna the stunna paint and it dries down matte it's liquid oh it's like the perfect perfect red um yeah so saturday like we have lunch and then we're just like kind of open um sunday we're going to be watching the game at rosa mexicana and we bought a package so it's unlimited food and bar from 2 to 7 p.m so we're going to be eating good we're going to be watching the game we're going to be having so much fun um we're also staying on monday so monday is like I think it's pretty open. Oh, Monday night we're going to be in Essex at Cosmopolitan, and then we're also changing hotels. So we're gonna be staying the first three nights in our timeshare, um, which is off the strip at the Tahiti uh, Village. Um, and then we're gonna be moving over to Planet Hollywood the last night. That way we're like on the strip, so we still get that uh, experience. If you're planning trips, I suggest that, especially to Vegas, like, um, I like to hotel hop. <laughs> I just like to stay in different places. Each place has like a different vibe. Uh, so then we'll kind of be like more in like the mix of things Monday and we're going to be in Essex. And then, um, yeah, Tuesday, Tuesday, what are we doing? Maybe Tuesday is the day that we were to play in Hollywood. I think it is. And then Tuesday is like kind of open. And then I believe we're coming back. We might be coming back on Tuesday, the 13th. Is Tuesday is the 13th on Tuesday I think so um so it's kind of like a short little trip but it's gonna be so much fun and like oh I cannot wait okay guys so I've done a little bit of packing I'm not getting ready for work but I just have to tell you about the time really quick that I went to Vegas and I didn't bring any of my makeup the only makeup I brought with me was like a lip liner and I had some pressed powder, which I never used pressed powder as a foundation, but I literally just survived the entire trip. It was a family trip, so it wasn't like we were like going out out, but I survived the entire trip with only that makeup, which was crazy. So now as a hack, I pack my makeup as I'm doing my makeup the day before. Um, so I will not forget anything because let me tell you, going on vacation without your makeup, 10 out of 10 do not recommend, okay? Don't be me. Pack your makeup as you do your makeup. Um, I don't plan on wearing makeup, I think, to Vegas tomorrow. Like I said, it's like we're road tripping and God only knows how long it's going to take us. Um, I'm just going to wait till we get checked into our hotel and then I'll like do my makeup, um, once we're like out and about on the town, but I just had to pause really quick and give you that little snippet story.